Hey friends, welcome back. So today I have some more birthday entries. This is going to be 19 through 23. So as always, I'll leave everybody's links in my description box if you want to go check them out, show them some crafty love. And let's go ahead and get started. So number 19 comes from Tina. I'm going to pull everything out of here. Okay. So let's see what she has here. Maybe a card. Let's see this one first. Okay. So this is her YouTube channel, which is Tina Loves to Craft. So you guys can go check her out. And this one is blank. So this must be an entry here. It says Make a Wish. Super cute. And she does a lot of um, mixed media too and albums and journals. So um, if you guys are interested in that, you'll definitely enjoy her channel. I like that little bling there. And then what is this? She did send some extra goodies. This is like a little envelope here with like this, um, look at this, uh, like a huge <laughs> stamp. That is cool. So this is the type of stuff that she likes to do. So if you guys like that, oh, it looks like she sent some more than one um, card. So this is like a, um, like a front base for a card. So that's perfect. I can add that to something. Thank you. And just add a little sentiment there. And here's another one with some pretty florals. She did all this. I'm not sure if this is paper piecing or maybe this is embossed. And then she goes back and outlines it. That's what it looks like. How cool is that? I I feel like it's in, this might be a die cut but or ephemera, but I don't know. This feels like it's embossed. So that's really cool. And then she also sent me some of these like acetate strips. And I've bought these before. So this is cool. All right, and then looks like she also included, um, I'm not sure if this is, this is some printables that she printed out and sent to me. So this is really cool little design here. Oh, this is like, like, um, I guess you could fold these and turn them into cards. I think that's what, and then this would be her little stamp on the back of it. Yeah, you cut these out and it's um, pretty good decent quality of cardstock. So that's what she did. She sent me some cards that I can cut out and fold and then add my own sentiments. That was really neat. I like this idea. And then here's another one. That is so cute. And then there's this one. Look at that. You are so loved. How cute is that? And the last one, which is this one here. This one's cute. And I love how it has all like the sewing and fabric details. That is so cool. Thank you, Tina. This is awesome. Thank you so much. That's going to come in handy. And then the next one is from Bethany. So I'm just going to go ahead and pull that out. And this is entry number 20. So let's see here. This might be, oh, okay. So she has all the envelopes in here. So this must be all the cards. I love this die. I have it as well. It's the envelope die. Oh my gosh. Let's see if her information, because I don't recognize the name. Um, for the YouTube channel or Instagram, it just has her first name. So Bethany, you will have to let me know. Okay, here we go. All right, Bethany Parlette. So she must just have an Instagram account. Oh my gosh, look at how pretty these cards are. Let's go over them here. It says happy birthday and then all this stitching. Absolutely love it. It's like Maggie Holmes papers. And then, oh, there's a little note in this one. So let me see this really quick. <clears throat> and she is your crafty BFF on Instagram. So I'll have to check out. <laughs> Thank you. I was just reading her note, guys. Okay. So she has that one. And she did this one here. Oh, I'm just loving the gold. And then she has Hooray. 
so pretty these are like all my favorite colors this one says thanks so cute there's another one that says hello and this one says celebrate very pretty and this one has like um, splatters of gold on there as well look at that so cute thank you so so much and I love the little container there that you did and then the other one is 21 which is Miss Val and pull everything out of her package here okay so I think there's a little note that slipped out so let me read this really quick <laughs> it's funny how a lot of you guys say how um you guys aren't card makers but you guys are still joining my challenge and that's the reason why i did this challenge because i say i'm not a card maker either so that's kind of funny okay but i'm still glad you guys are joining even though you don't like to make cards like me <laughs> Cool. So this one is a Christmas one and look it's a shaker. That is a really pretty one. It's a good size Christmas um, tree shaker card too. That's nice. And she has that blank inside there. Oh, she sent me some goodies. She sent me some. Oh my gosh, look how cute this is. I know a lot of you guys are little um, Hello Kitty fans. That's really pretty. I like how you did that. I think she just added this clip here. That's cute. And then she sent me some little strips, adhesive strips. I remember these came from Dollar Tree. Butterflies and then these floral pieces. Not sure if I ever um, got these prints, but those are cool. And then she sent me some snowflake stickers from Jolie's. Very nice. Thank you so much for that. And then here is another card. Here is um, one that has like little mittens there and it says Merry Christmas. Thank you so much, girl. Love it. Thank you for all the little goodies as well. And then moving along to number 22. This one is from Maria Lewis. So we'll have to see what her social media is as well. Okay. She sent hers in a vellum envelope too, so that was cool. So here's like a little note. So let me get into that first. Okay, so she is, um, this is Mary Carmen. Yeah, so made by, at made by Mary Carmen. So I'll have to check to see it. That might be like an Instagram logo there. So thank you so much for joining and look at her shaker. Happy birthday. I think this is actually like from a cupcake little piece there from a cupcake topper. That is cute. I like how she did that. Aw, she sent a little um, dingle here. Let's see what's, I like this little bag too. How cute. Oh, this is pretty. I like how she did that. So she just added it on like a little a little acrylic piece there. And then she has this clear sticker, the little pink um, chain, and then a puffy sticker with the, the bow, and then another little two little beads there. How or not beads. Well the beads here, but the little charms. How cute. This is so cute to add to a project. Thank you so much. Absolutely love that. All right, and our last one for today is from Judy, and she is Red Princess Designs. And I noticed she put this um, sticker here, it says Challenge Entry, and I love this idea. So I don't know if you make them, but this is cute. I needed to get something like that. So let's see what she made here. So here are her two cards. <clears throat> she has this one that says a party. How cute. 
She just layered two different um, cardstocks and then some flags. Has the word party there. Love that. And then here's another one. She did the same thing. I like how she did that. That was a super cute idea. This one says it's Sherbet, uh, Sherbet Day. Yay. That is cute. Oh, she did right. This one is for me. Let me see here. She wrote a little note. Oh, thank you. Yeah, so this one is for me. And then she included some little happy birthday stickers. And then this is all her information. Thank you, Judy, so much. I'm glad you were able to participate. All right, guys, that is all that I have for you today. I'm trying to put as many entries together and put videos out so I don't get behind. And um, I will be going on vacation um, in a few days, too. So hopefully I get a lot of these filmed before I go. All right, we'll see you guys in my next one. Don't forget to check everybody's information in my description box. You can go give them a follow, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.